Namaskar, good evening, and a very warm welcome to my very first episode with Encounter with Alok. Sponsored by Zozo DMC, which is a destination management based company out in Scotland and England. It does a lot of FIT tour groups, it does a lot of group tours to UK and Europe. This podium, this platform has been made to entertain all of you and to acquire knowledge. Today, the very first guest is a daughter of Puneet and Nidhi Divedi from Edinburgh all the way. We are going to connect to Arya Divedi. So here we go. Hello, Arya. Hello. How are you? I'm good, thanks. How are you? Yes, uh, So far, so good, Arya Bitta. Thank you for asking. So how is the weather there in Edinburgh? Uh, it's okay. Okay, very good. So, uh, tell, are uh, you comfortable? You good to go, yeah? Yep. Very good. So, my, you are very warm welcome on the show. And this is the first episode and I have chosen you as my guest. So, thank you, thank you. So, here we go. We start. Can you introduce yourself to my all my viewers? Okay. Namaste. My name is Arya Devedi and I am eight years old. Um, and I'm from Edinburgh. Uh, my dad's name is Puneet Devedi and he's an IT consultant. And my mum's name is Nidhi Devedi and uh, she works for a bank. My dad is also, um, uh, he also helps with uh, social organizations like HFB in the form of Britain Interface and VHS. What does VHS stand for? Uh, VHS stands for Virat Hindustan Sangam. Oh, that's good. Sounds good. Okay. So, what does Arya means? What does it mean? Um, Arya is from a Sanskrit word, and that Sanskrit word means noble person. Okay. And also, as you know, Durga Ji um has one hundred eight names, and my name is one of the one hundred eight names. Wow. To be honest, I didn't knew that, but now I know that. Now I can tell that Goddess Durga has the name meaning of Arya as well. So good. Okay, Arya. So, you know, as the world is facing the crisis of pandemic and everyone is struggling, even I'm from hospitality background and travel background. So I am struggling as well. Entire world is struggling and we are praying God that hopefully it, the situations becomes better and we are on the track. So what are you doing? What preventions are you taking in Corona time? Uh, at this time, it's really tough, as everybody knows. Uh, some people are dying, and it's really sad to see. Uh, so what we're trying to do, we're following the government guidelines, not going to Very somebody good. else's house, social distancing, 20-second hand washing. So see, guys, from this podium, I would like to tell when an eight-year-old child can follow the government guidelines, so why can't we? That's the most important thing. Sochna padega. Think before you leap. Okay, Arya, we go to the next question. How, like in this time, I know you're not going to schools because lockdowns are there. Yeah. So how are you managing your studies? What activities are you doing? So what courses you are doing? So I just want to know about schoolings. Well, um, we're trying to communicate by the app called Microsoft Teams and that's helping us to communicate really well so um, in that if you're feeling down you can uh, help your friends talk to your friends on the chat if you're stuck you can ask your teacher your teacher can send out activities maths any subject and it's um and it's a new way to learn wow that, that's that sounds interesting a new way to learn very good area Okay, so what are you doing to keep yourself fit? Means in terms of like you're doing any yoga, you're doing any exercises, what are you doing? Well, um, I try to jump about. I like doing cartwheels and gymnastics at home. So when there's space, I just try to do that and okay. jump about. But also from school, they give us, uh, what do you call uh, PE physical education. Okay. So for that, sometimes they give you different fitness activities that help wow. you keep fit. 
Wow, that sounds very good. So that means school is taking care of it. So yes, because are telling there's you. lots of tricky things or easy things. It could be it could be running, playing with balls. It could be a new activity. Wow. So what are you doing in your spare time? What after school activities and these all? Do you help mom in cleaning and or anything? What do you do? Well, first of all, I would like to tell you that I have started putting some videos on YouTube. Oh my God! Really? And I started like doing some cooking and all that stuff. Wow! So second thing I would like to tell you is, um, I try to help my mom as much as I can, and also, yeah. um, in lockdown, I've learned how to make tea or chai. Oh, sounds amazing! So, do you know uh, how to make masala chai? Uh, yes, I make the Indian masala chai. Very good. So, okay, viewers, here we go. A secret recipe of Arya Divedi. Next to you, Arya. Okay. Come on, here you go. Okay, I'll tell you. Uh, so, for this, how I make it, my parents actually really like my tea. So, for this, uh, what I do is I put boiling hot water, and then I put two or three. Uh, I put boiling hot water into a pan, and then I put two or three um, tea bags. Mm -hmm. And then if you really want the flavor of ginger in it and the really strong flavor in tea, then you can add a little ginger in it. Mm -hmm. And then I wait for it to become like brownie or like bright black. Okay. After it's bright black, then I add some sugar into it and one and a half to two cups of milk. And then I mix oh. it with a spoon. And then I just wait for it to get foamy and bubbly. And then after a few bubbles come up, uh, I pour it if I can. But if there's too much, my mom just helps me out. <laughs> okay. Very good, Arya. Means I have followed the recipe. I know how to make tea, but I'll try yours as well. I'll give it a go. Okay. okay. So, Arya, I have heard that you recite and chant mantras very well. And to be honest, I'll be honest to you, I have followed you on YouTube as well. And I've seen 14 to 15 mantras. Your well, videos. Thank you. Well, I try my best. Very good, better. So, can you recite two or three uh, mantras so that my viewers can listen to you? Okay. Um, this one is about like it's a very powerful healing mantra, I think. And okay. for this, um, I hope by this mantra, the negativity in the world right now, the COVID-19, it just comes to an end and there's peace in the world and people stop dying. And it's about Lord Shiva as well. Wow. Shivji ke baare mein hai. So okay. I'll, I'll recite this one. It's the Mahamritan Mantra. Okay. Om Trayambakam Yajamahe Sugandhim Pushtivardhanam Wow, sounds amazing. My, you can see my everything. I'm, I'm shocked. Okay, here we go. Another one, please. I um, okay. means feeling very good. This is about all the gurus, um, all the great teachers out there. And I would like to say to Galmir Primary School in Edinburgh because um, that's my school, and I love the teachers there. Wow. And um, uh, this is about teachers and gurus who teach you, including your parents. So, so teachers and parents for you. Om Guru Brahma, Guru Vishnu, Guru Devo Maheshwarai, Guru Sakshat Para Brahma, Tashmai Shri Guru Venamaha. Very good, Arya. Seriously, very proud of you, Beta. And such Thank a small you. age, what you are doing, it's, it's, I can't say, I don't have words. Very good. I've, I've learned quite a few and I try my best to recite them. No, oh, really nice, really nice. So should we move to another round? The first round has okay. entered and you have done very well, Arya, I must say. Very okay. good. So we are going to round two. So round two, we go and we will we'll be knowing more about Arya's liking. Yeah. And what Arya thanks for. Okay. So, Arya, who's your favorite actor? Um, I like Tiger Shroff and Akshay Kumar. Okay. Any particular reason about it, them? Well, um, Tiger Shroff is really fit, flexible, and confident, and he does some good movies. 
Okay, very good. And I like Akshay Kumar because he's also pretty fit and um, he does really good movies. He, um, most of his movies are funny as well, but they always have a funny, good, inspiring message in them as well. Wow, very good. Akshay, if you hear this message from Arya, she is a big fan of yours. Very good. Okay, what's your favorite cuisine like? Um, I like Indian it and Italian. And can I tell you something funny? Okay, go it ahead. Let's start with I. <laughs> That's very good. So, what's your favorite food in Italian and um, Indian? Um, I would say, as I'm, uh, me and my family are vegetarian, I would say I like vegetarian pizza and pasta. I think many kids like that. Yeah, you are right. And what about Indian cuisine? Indian, I like quite a few things, actually. I like the very famous street food, Pani Puri or Golgatte. Oh, wow. Um, and I like Palak Paneer. That's like one of my favorite. I've even made that in one of my YouTube videos. That's mouth watering. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Very good. And I also like one more thing. Sattu Ka Paratha. Sattu Ka Paratha. What does Sattu mean, Arya, if you don't mind uh, sattu telling me? Sattu is a roasted chickpea powder, I think. And okay. you, um... Uh, put some spices in that if you want, and you uh, put it in dough. So very well it. answered. Very well answered, Arya. It's one of the very famous, you know, in uh, in India, there is a state called Bihar, and they make Sattuka Paratha, Litti Chokha over there. Very famous dish. And also, um, you can also make Litti with that, but that's more like round. You're right. You're right. Very good. So we move to another, uh, means next question. When do you think means what was one of the most memorable day in your life? I think there are quite a few, but there's a lot of many good days in my life. But I would say the most recent and loving and most special day for me recently would be when my sister was born. Wow, very nice. So what's her name? Uh, her name is Mahi, actually. Everybody only knows Mahi. But her formal name is Shania. Shania, very good. And how old is she? Uh, she's just six months old. Oh. And a few days. Six wow. months. Wow. She's very small. So very good. That uh, means it, you have a baby in house. That's the most exciting thing. Yeah. Two sisters especially make that, a loving bond. This, uh, sorry, what were you saying? No, no, I was saying it makes a special bond. No, go ahead. Yeah. Yes. Uh, so what I was saying, for now, it's really important to have somebody funny or a sibling because right now we're stuck at home and we can't do really anything. Wow. So it's nice to play with her sometimes. So what's your favorite cartoon uh, or Disney character like? Whom do you like the most and why? I like Moana. Moana. Okay, why? Uh, she is this girl and she's really cute and I like her because she was really strong and determined to get past the water in the movie. Oh, sounds good. Being honest, I've never watched, but I would love to watch now. After mm -hmm. you telling me, I'll go and watch it. Moana. I'll remember it. Okay, so most beautiful place in the world, what, what, which, which place would you say it? Although I've been to many countries and many different places, I would still say Scotland because this is where I was born and it's cynically beautiful as well, especially the Highlands because I would say it's kind of like a mini Switzerland. Although I've not been, I've seen pictures of Switzerland. From this medium, from this podium, through Aria, I would tell my viewers and our sponsors, Zozo DMC, who has sponsored, they are based out in Scotland and England, Highland and Scotland as a tourist destination. Do watch, do keep in mind. Okay, so what lessons COVID-19 has taught you? Um, I would say, um, I think there's very, uh, two very important points okay. for this answer. I would say, first of all, not only the NHS, NHS, but NHS, 
front key work workers, police, ambulance, and all these key workers help us so much. And sometimes, unless you're sick or unless this COVID-19 came, actually we didn't really realize. And now NHS staff and key workers help us a lot. And they're really hard working even now because especially at this time they're risking their lives because um, lots of people have the COVID-19 and few doctors are dying because they're helping, they're trying their best and uh, they get COVID-19. Very good. So you are telling, basically you, are t you want to tell that frontline key staff is very important so we should respect them and we should understand their importance in life. Very good, yes. Arya. That's very good. And my okay. second point was, yep. um, right now we're staying at home so much, so now we realize like our family and friends are so important. Like You can only stay with family for now, and it's so important to stay together. But right now, um, you can't even meet your friends that live a wee bit far. So um, we are also um, thinking about look, uh, now we can't meet our friends as well. And they were actually so nice. So the importance of family and friends, you understand in the time of Corona, yeah? Am I right, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Very good. So you have passed out second round as well and you have done pretty well, I'm, I'm glad. So yeah. now we move to third round, which is okay. the final, third most final round, which is called our rapid fire, fire, fire round, okay? Okay. So you will be asked 10 questions. Okay. If you think it's you don't want to answer, just say pass. Okay. But if you answer it, our viewers will listen to it and they will act upon it and they will have a fun. This, this podium is to all entertain people. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So okay. should we go ahead, Arya? Okay. Okay. Dogs. Here we go. I like the word when you say okay. Uh -huh. Okay. So. The first question of rapid fire round. Here we go. Would you rather swim to school or run to school? I like swimming, so I would go for swimming. Favorite color in rainbow? Uh, I like violet. Who makes better food, mommy or daddy? I think it's depending on what the food is because sometimes mommy, sometimes daddy. Diplomatic. When Corona time is over, would you go on holiday or meet your best friend? Meet my best friend, I think. If you would love to go on holiday, which place you would prefer, Switzerland or Portugal? Um, I would say Switzerland because I've already went to Portugal. Would you go on long holiday or to stay or home without study or homework? I think long holiday. Okay. Do you sleep with mouth open or closed? Oh, this is a funny one. I think I sleep with my mouth closed. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. You prefer Virat Kohli or Leon Messi? I think I would say Virat Kohli. If you have a restaurant, what would you serve? Oh my God. I would choose my favorite things. Sweets and sweets and desserts. Mm. <laughs> okay. The last question, last and very important question of rapid fire round. Okay. If a genie comes in front of you, mm -hmm. what it would be asking the last wish? For now, I think it's very important that I just ask that all this COVID-19 goes away and the, and the world comes to peace and we get back our normal life. Very nice. Very smartly answered, Arya. Really proud of you. So, guys, okay. I'm really very, very Thankful to Arya Divedi who has done a very full, very wonderful job today. And thank you, Arya, for coming on my show and very first show. So I thank you thank very you. much as well. Oh, thank you from bottom of my heart. So want to tell everyone that this podium is made to entertain all of you, and we will see you every Saturday, according to UK time, three o'clock, and Indian time, seven thirty. So till then, enjoy your weekends. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Bye-bye. Bye. See you all later. Bye, Arya. Thank you.